Following injury, swelling occurs distal to the injury, secondary to the venous insufficiency. This is caused in the veins by the one-way valves not closing completely, allowing blood to backfill and pool in the tissues, resulting in edema. To address this problem that is associated with acute injury, the healthcare provider should elevate the limb and apply compression. Elevation will decrease the hydrostatic pressure in the capillary beds. By elevating the limb to 45 degrees, the effect of gravity is 71%. Effects of elevation alone are short-lived. It is recommended that a compression device be applied to the limb in conjunction with this elevation. Compression devices can be circumferential or sequential. Circumferential devices apply compression with equal pressure around the area. Sequential compression devices have compartments that fill from distal to proximal, pushing fluids toward the heart. Venous return will be directly proportionate to the pressure gradient applied to the limb. Sequential compression set at lower pressure will cause absorption at a slower rate compared. Increasing the pressure gradient with a high pressure setting using sequential compression creates a high pressure gradient distally and a lower pressure gradient proximally. Thus, fluid can move from a high pressure area to a low pressure area, allowing for increased lymphatic drainage.